This, this is my tornado machine. Built from a Storm Chaser video. Actually, it was a Storm Chaser's how-to video. This was the biggest one you could build uh, with the instructions. It's 48 inches high in the chamber there. So, um, let's see how the, uh, how the tornado, how well the tornado will form now. I plug in the, the fans. Here we go. There she goes. A very excellent tornado. Actually, this machine more closely resembles a water spout or a land spout and not a true tornado. And if you're into meteorology, you'll understand the difference. Anyway, the, uh, the tubes there on the side create wind shear. There's forced air going through them. And then up above is a regular 12-inch floor fan that we use to create the updraft. And underneath is an ultrasonic humidifier, and that creates the vapor trail to allow you to see the uh, vortex of uh, air inside the chamber. And I, I put green, uh, not green, but uh, black 55-gallon uh, garbage bags around the sides. It'll create a tornado without them, but you can't see them real well. And since this is out in my garage and not up against the wall in the house, I use the bags to uh, reduce the turbulence in the chamber. What I should do is just get some mesh screen and put it all the way around except in the front. Then I can move it around wherever I want. So anyway, I'll back off here a little bit so you can see the whole thing. So there you have it. A homemade tornado. I get up close here, you should be able to see the uh, updraft in the very center. That darker column is the updraft column. And with that, I'll say thanks for watching.